guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is val i create content around fashion beauty and lifestyle if you're new here please consider subscribing leaving a like leaving a comment if you resonate with us and if we are serving you your kind of jazz all right so somebody called me out yesterday for not being on this app for the past 11 days child your girl has been living right i've just been breathing and just surviving out here in the streets all right but here we are um I just showered and did my skincare. I'm already wearing my moisturizer and my sunscreen, but I'm about to do a super mild um, makeup look, which I'm gonna be sharing with you guys in a few seconds. But before I do that, I'm gonna be doing a mini Miniso haul, all right? I am obsessed with Miniso at this point, you guys can tell. I, I just find myself inside a store, all right? But on this purchase it was not random it wasn't impulse buying i am honestly running out of makeup and i needed to restock but because um i couldn't get ugh, what am i even saying i can get zaran stuff from other places but because miniso is stocking zaran products i was like let me just stop by and see if i can get something that i normally use from there so that's where I got my makeup from and I got a few things as well from there because there's always something to buy at Mini. So that aside, my girl see me on Instagram is partially the reason behind this purchase because this girl was on my DMs at what time? At almost 8, 9 in the morning. Like, girl, you need to go to Mini so right now because they've stocked amazing face masks and i was like say no more say less and i rushed on there and i got this three beautiful masks which are super super affordable this one is a ceramide one this one is a collagen one and this one has rose uh bulgur in it which is super super amazing for soothing your skin so that's it for the masks i got this hair clips if you follow me on instagram you've already seen the um the cream one but i also got this pastel um purple one and this black one because why not and if you see somebody going somewhere more than once to get the same thing that means that thing is nice it's, it's doing what it's supposed to do guys if this falls and i flash you guys i'm gonna be terrified so i'm holding on for dear life as we speak <laughs> next thing are these two beauty blenders they come together as a package and i really really like the fact that it is like that so it's going to be amazing for um powdering your under eye or blending out your um concealer looks like that this other one is super super brilliant because you can use it for foundation at the bottom and you can use it for your under eye on the sides so use it like this use it like that which is great i i love that for me next thing is this eyelash curler i've always wanted to own an eyelash curler but i've never owned eyelash curler the reason being i have no idea but i got this um pink metallic one beautiful the fact that it's metallic i'm going to be using it for a while that's if i don't lose it makeup things you just lose them all the time but yeah that's the eyelash curler uh i also got this cat eye sunnies they look like this they ha i like the fact that they have like animal print accents and the fact that they're cat eye and they has they have this spaces on the side which makes them super super chic and they're gonna fit my aesthetic so so well i can't wait to wear the hell out of those ones and then i also got this beautiful beautiful earrings let me just wear them first but i can show you guys they look like that they're rose gold you guys know that i'm obsessed with rose gold and they're stainless so guys for the makeup i've decided to show you guys as i go right as i apply then i show you what is going on my um my spoolie is at faith's house so try to make it to your edges let nobody judge me okay it works just as fine all right so i'm going to be doing my eyebrows super super quickly my mirror is broken it's a mess People tell me, oh, do you like a, a eyebrow tutorial? Guys, I don't have anything incredible to tell you about eyebrows. But I could do an eyebrow tutorial if you want. 
but I like my eyebrows looking um, more natural than glam so I don't like it like super clean and super you know no that's not my vibe maybe if I'm doing a glam makeup look then I can go that route but for a normal day absolutely not I wouldn't do that on a normal day but yeah Mulisa my eyebrows ni nini cousins and my sisters these ones could be made up at this point because they look nothing alike <laughs> they look nothing alike oh my god they could be childhood friends or something probably went to the same school <laughs> But yeah, that's that. Let's try out the makeup because I don't like concealing with um with uh what is it called? My concealer is super super light. Because your concealer I'm gonna under eye, not eyebrows, so I can't use that. Oh I am so mean. So this is the foundation. I got it from Mini So it's in the shade 40. Normally I use shade 45, I don't know why. When this girl was tasting the foundation with me 40 worked better so i hope it's gonna do a good job i'm not procedure moja crazy eyebrows i'm sorry guys this is just it this is how, this is how i do my eyebrows on a normal day So that's that. So that's that for the eyebrows, guys. I want to do my foundation now. I'm just um, making my my blender a little bit dumb. I'm going to be using um, this beauty blender. And I don't like having the product um, all around my face. I'd rather have it like on my palm right like this. And then I figure my way out from, from there. Don't avoid issues are... Uh, look look cakey oh my god it better not be too light because i would feel that so much so zaron foundation is buildable so you can start kidogo as you build up depending on what kind of cover-up you want um sometimes i don't want um full coverage sometimes i do oh my god i'm really panicking but it's let's see let's just blend it and see if it's my shade or it's definitely not my shade not bad and it's very natural looking as well you see so with having your foundation here rather than having it direct on your skin you you're able to maneuver it around and see if you like how it looks and if you don't like it you add it on until it gives you the look that you want kuliko we came in and then now you struggle with blending you blend out on your skin and me i like a natural um finish so Hmm. I think 40 is it. Is it? You guys, comment down below. Do you feel like this is my shade? Or it's too light for me? Comment down below. So, that's the foundation. So far, so good. I don't feel like I look like I'm wearing too much makeup, which... I'm obsessed with let's move on to concealer so guys i went ahead and did my um my concealer my under eye concealer and my setting powder i did not do it on camera because i was using a juvia's powder and 
a BH Cosmetics concealer palette. So yeah, if you guys want a full detailed um, tutorial on how I do my everyday makeup look, please do tell. I can do a whole video solely um, um, for that. But for now, I'll, I'm just going to do like um, a tutorial and showing you guys the things that I got from, from Zaron. So because those two are not from Zaron, cheers. So this is how I look so far. I'm going to do, I don't use powder, guys. I don't use powder. I don't know how I feel about this, but yeah, I'll just powder um, the parts that I feel like needs powdering. Oh my God, me and opening packages now. Like, this is pretty so this is how the packaging of the compact powder looks like it's mattifying looks like that when you open it this is what you get so beautiful oh, they have a sponge so cute okay so all right mm, all right um, I feel like if I used a brush, it's gonna be better than using a sponge. So let's do that. Guys, I'm not a powder girl. So I am so confused right now. I'm just doing what I think works. So please don't judge me. And I won't judge you. Okay. Okay, it is quite mortifying, guys. Like, yo. Ciao. Okay, I don't hate it. Let's just see how it goes from in here. Setting spray, not a setting spray from Zara, and it's my Fix It Prep and Prime from Mark. But yeah, uh, I haven't done anything to the eyes, so. Eyeliner from Zaren looks like that. Um, that's the one. Super, super beautiful. I haven't done eyeliner in ages. So, I don't know if I'm going to do... I am panicking, guys, if you can tell. But I don't know if I can do a good job. Who do I think I am doing eyeliner on camera? Gosh. So that's, that's that eye. Cousins for sure. No, I believe in my focus, guys. I'm too crazy, and I don't know my eyes are tight. Curly, curly, curly. Hey, hey, my nannies are doing the most. My um, my lashes. <laughs> but yeah, that's the eyeliner. Eco messy kidogo. I'll clean it up. That's how um. Guys, believe me when I tell you that. Guys, this video is such a mess. Tell me why I did my eyeliner before I curled my, my lashes. Tell me why. Tell me why right now. Because yo, I think that's why Atta my Nini's are doing the most. My lashes, they were just getting in the way of a. Uh, of me doing my nini or my liner keep messing it up so 
so yeah i think i'm set for mascara i will touch up that eyeliner definitely because it's driving me insane anyway this is the mascara looks like that it's a volumizing mascara the wand looks like so lord jesus is really moist god huh? guys can you show the difference between the two eyes this is crazy It really does give volume. It does. Can you tell the difference? This one I took a bunch of the mascara. Yeah, so that's the mascara. I can I can fix the liner kidogo. Aki mira. Ni ugly, ni si ni judge. Ili vunjika imagine. And somebody would ask, Sili mama mira sijuzi tuwe nini ni ndi ni mamba ili vunjika maja. I'm so cute. Is that better? I don't know. I think so. Okay. That's it for the eye makeup. Uh I'll do my blush. This is from Juvia's guys. I'm sorry, I don't have blush from um from Zaron. So this will have to do, but it does an incredible job if I do say so myself. Highly, highly recommend. Highly, highly recommend. It's like I don't know when to stop and I need to stop that behavior honestly because I don't have any business walking around looking pink everywhere but it's cute I I like adding some blush on the, on the tip of my nose if you ask me why I wouldn't have an answer for you but but yeah I've exhausted everything that's Zaron everything that I'm gonna be using for, from here is not from Zaron, sadly. But yeah, I feel like I've done justice in telling you guys um on keep putting you guys on on things that I got from Miniso that are from Zaron. I'm I'm using my Morphe palette to do my contouring. This is the palette. Mm, yeah, that is what I'm using. I don't know if I need to buy new blushes, blushes, brushes, gosh. But the ones that I use are multi-purpose. They do so much for me. They do like more than one thing. Bro, universe spoke. I just mentioned, I just asked if I could, if I should buy new brushes and then my brush fell apart. Maybe I should buy new brushes. I don't know. I think I look okay. I look just not incredible, but I look okay. My favorite part. Maybelline lift a gloss in the shade I have for I mean, Mary Kutika. I can't see the shade, sorry guys. But it was an offer on Jumia 9.99. This is the final look. I don't hate it. 
it's cute also peep my earrings from miniso super super cute i don't hate this makeup look but if you guys want a detailed um everyday makeup look or makeup routine that i do please do comment down below and i will do a video that's entirely dedicated for that so yeah i'm gonna make some tea because i'm semi hungry so i'm gonna do that and then i get something to oh my god why is it so itchy get something to wear and then we head out java love cookies with my tea me and java anything count me presents count me present i have a delivery that i'm supposed to do right now a very beautiful slip dress one of the subscribers oh my god you girl you support me so much and then also i need to go to eat out to get my charger i have things that i need to take the phone to go to bed so it's about to go it's about to go down fit of the day i retained this top but i added a blazer just in case the weather acts up i'm wearing this distressed pants they are from zara and then i'm wearing those white sneakers and that my friends is the outfit of the day let's get going yeah. one of my most incredible subscribers and we follow each other on instagram so we constantly constantly speak and keep in touch and she's the one that has bought something from me and i did the delivery myself because i was like i have we've planned to okay we've been in places but we never got to meet so today i was like let me go and meet her she got me yogurt she's so pretty i have the most incredible get girl like gang on social media i am so impressed wow she bought me yogurt yo i'm so happy i'll have that for breakfast tomorrow okay that aside i am in eat out we were filming a podcast on the weekend and i left my charger here so i've come to get it tell me why they're closed but they have a notice that says uh they'll be open from four so i'll just go do my errands a la for journey but i'm so happy that i met i got to meet the babes at them so happy so happy i'm over the moon girl vane you are so beautiful and i was so happy to meet you okay you guys know that right now i'm so happy let me just go hello so i'm currently at pete's oh my god this is the cutest little cafe if you want to just have fun and feel cute and just feel the aesthetics and the vibes, come to feet. Look at the bathroom. Guys. What? This is so cute. Oh my god. So I'm still waiting for my food. I decided to come to the bathroom because I was pressed as hell and I was a little bit hungry. Um, I already have my stuff at D Square, so I decided to come and get some food here. It's been a minute since I came to Clarice. Why am I going to eat Pete's? It changed from Pete's to Clarice, guys. So I'm going to take my food and I just decided to check in with you guys. Super, super cute. I am so happy to be here. You have no idea.
Okay, I've spent so much time at D square. Why is this shaking? I've spent so much time at D square. I was having um, this spice that I got from Elsie Waikiki, and you know how the trouser fits you, and then the waist does nothing at the back. Yeah. That's what these pants were doing, so I got them altered. This one is so cute. And then I also took this orange one to be altered as well. So things were not going where I wanted them to go. So the pants look how I wanted them to look. But eventually we got there. I'm so glad. People at DSC are very patient. I'm so grateful for them. How is my makeup looking? I don't know. It's the end of the day. It's almost five. So yeah, that being said, I am so happy I met Vani. She got me this. Oh, is it? Oh, I've taken it to the fridge already. Yeah, Alini Lecha Yoga. Oh, it's just been a beautiful day. I had an incredible time at Clara's. I had a meeting there. So, yeah, I just covered when I was still waiting because obviously I couldn't bring you guys with me to the meeting. It would have been awkward. But other than that, it's been a good day if I just say so myself. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video as much as I have filming it for you guys. And now, Penda Sana, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.